Now, this one is finally something that we would use ourselves. JSON validate is coming to PHP. And I can show you how as a, how bummer it was to you kind of validate if a JSON was valid. So let's go back to our sublime text here. Let's just type something like JSON string equals to uh, valid JSON. Let's just type name equals to, let's see someone on the chat. Let's see Mary, for example, okay? So if we were to type something like this, okay? And you were to, our job is validate this JSON, not kind of access to the JSON data, but just check if this thing is valid. You would have to type something like this, okay? Okay, I'm gonna decode this stuff. I'm gonna decode this JSON string. And then the is valid stuff would basically uh, be the result of this JSON less error expression. So you would have to decode the thing, not encode, decode the thing and then check for the last error. So if I run this and if I try to uh, var dump the is valid variable, hopefully I get a true. And I do. Pretty cool, right? However, if I'm gonna make, if I were to make this JSON invalid, for example, just like this, I get a false. So our code is working as expected. Uh, however, now we have something even better. So what we can do now is simply remove this uh, access to the result, to the um, to the JSON decode, and we can type something like this: JSON. Uh, let me check the function name. JSON validate. There we go. Just pass the JSON string and we get exactly the same result. This is not valid, however, if I fix the thing on the top, we get true now. So this is finally something that I believe is a bread, bread and butter addition, you know? Something that people actually use in the real world.